Hey, hey, it's me again. Come on in. you up. I gotcha, I gotcha. What's up? Did you miss me? <laughs> All right, so we are going to do the all ribbon ladybug kit I guess I'm a couple minutes early oh well people will find us hello and they can always watch the replay I'm just a minute early <laughs> so what you get in the kit is you get your large unique in the creek frame you get your bag of zip ties. Um, you get the Senna with the ladybugs and daisies to match the gorgeous ribbon. Um, you get one roll of the red ladybug and daisy ribbon. And you get two rolls of the red, white, and black polka dot. Okay. Now, I've already cut all of mine, so you still have enough ribbon um, that if you wanted to put more in it, you could, or you can add it to a wreath, um, whatever you want to do with the leftovers. Totally up to you, but you'll have plenty, okay? So, what I did was I took, where's my ones I didn't do, okay? So, you're going to need 40 of your red, white, and black strips cut at 12 inches, okay? You're gonna need 20 of this one cut at 12 inches, but then you cut it in half, so it still gives you 40 petals, okay? Um, then you're gonna dovetail them or ducktail them, however you want to do that. I see I am freezing, um, so I'll try to pause when I see that, okay? Um, so that's all I did. So 40 of these at 12 inches, 20 of these at 12 inches, and then cut in half, okay? So let me bring you down. Hello, hello. It's not freezing there? Okay, it was my laptop just kind of blipped for a minute. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your one strip of the red, white, and black, find your middle, and then scrunch it right down the middle. Let me get my, my doodads out. Okay, and then flip it up and then I kind of lay them down kind of lining them up side by side and then go ahead and where'd it go <laughs> go ahead and just rubber band them or um, clip them however you want to do it just like that phone out of the way okay so that's kind of what we have hello hello and um, this kit is already sold out um, I do have more coming okay then you're gonna take the one piece that you cut in half and just scrunch that bottom together and then um, rubber band it or clip it however you want to do that um, I find that I can't hold them so it was easier for me just to band them. Okay, and then I'm taking the yellow and putting it right over 
the red, white, and black. And then we're just gonna zip tie them in. I think I buried my, or did I take them in the other room? Nope, they're right here. Whew. I don't have to go anywhere. Ha. Get that one out of the way. Okay. And that's all we're going to do. Take one, put it over the other. And then just start putting them in, y'all. You want one? They'll be back in stock, I promise. So very easy. But I can't wait to see this one done. That bright yellow. So I'm just putting one in every set of holes. They'll be back. Should be back by next week, I'm hoping. But the regular Ladybug and Bee Kits will probably be out tomorrow if I can get caught up on orders again. I don't want to bring out another big kit while I'm trying to catch up. So hopefully I can get all these orders done today so that I can bring it out tomorrow. Hopefully. <laughs> Isn't this going to be cute? Oh my gosh, yes. Man, y'all are quiet today. Why are you so quiet? You can either kind of leave these flat, or you see what I'm doing? I'm just going up underneath and kind of giving it a little bit of a curl. Totally up to you. Red, white, and black are cut at 12 inches. And the yellow, daisy, and ladybug are cut at um, 12 inches, but then cut in half again. So you need 40 of the red, white, and black cut at 12 inches. And then you need 20 of the ladybug ribbon cut at 12 inches, but then cut in half again. Why are you mad at the world? This is your all ribbon wreath kit. That is currently sold out, but we'll be back. You're welcome. cute my live didn't post a Facebook it must cuz I see it I 
This is the large board. You're welcome. I know I love, love, love this ribbon. Now I'll go back through and I'll fluff all of the, the red ribbon as well. Just like I'm fluffing the yellow. Thanks. All right. Let's get these cut off. Rope and my zip tie broke. But because they're banded together, it doesn't matter. Just replace the zip tie and move on. That easy. Yep, this one's all ribbon. Now you can make your tail shorter if you wanted, but y'all know me and ribbon. I like ribbon, so I do my tails at 12 inches. I think Lori does hers at 10, um, but it's it's really, and another one broke, what the heck's going on? Um, it's really all in however you want to do it. But I like ribbons, so I'm always going to do longer tails. <laughs> Try this again. If you find that a lot of your zip ties are breaking, it might be the tension on your zip tie gun. You might need to take it down a notch. All right, where's my other piece that I didn't do? There it is. So you'll need 40 of these cut at 12 inches and dovetailed or ducktailed, whatever you want to do. Okay, find your middle, bring them up. I like to lay them down to make sure they're kind of even. And you can clip it or use your little elastic to hold them together. Just like that. Okay? And then we take the yellow, which you will need 20 of these, cut at 12 inches, and then cut in half again. Unless you want to use a whole one, but I don't. Um, but you will not have enough of this one to double up like this one. But I like just having one of the big petal. Now 
That way all of your ribbon really stands out. And you don't have so much that you can't even tell what's up. coming on a little bit later than what I really wanted to but the pool guy showed up finally because I had another geyser outside so he got that fixed and it turns out the last time he was here he didn't put the lid the huge dome on the tank down properly so it was his fault These kits will hopefully be available again next week. So that only cost me like $250 because he had to change the gasket too. I was like, really? But at least it wasn't anything major. See how I'm fanning those out to cover up that zip tie? Um, not usually. Usually by October, sometimes maybe mid-October we're still swimming. Um, but after that, there's no way I'm getting in there. Every once in a while the kids will get in. Well, they used to when they were kid kids. Monkey tried it once last year and he's like, mm, not happening. But now when they were you know, middle school, high school, they swam in that thing all year round. Not this girl, though. Well, luckily, we've never had any, like, real big issues with our pool, and we've had it, what, 12 or 13 years. So... And this one, wreaths like this will definitely, what in the heck, let's see if we can loosen that tension a little bit. So generally when that happens, it's not the zip ties, it's your zip tie gun, y'all. Just play with it until it quits doing that. <laughs> but my pool's not heated either. I don't see any real reason to get it heated. Just extra money and... No. And they can usually start swimming in it in May. Sometimes April. Just depends. I don't get in there till probably end of May, June, because <laughs> it has to be warm. 
No, it's not a bad batch of zip ties. It's my zip tie gun. And it's getting old. I mean, I've used this bad boy for how many years? Quite a few, so. Hello, hello. All right. Next row. Prep is really the hardest part of this one. And it's not hard, it's just time consuming. But the end product is so pretty. Oops, I put that one on backwards. Hold on. goes on top. <laughs> I love doing it this way. I mean, you can really see the ribbon. You can tell what it is. Just hear that? Squirrel, we're having fun on my roof. The bees on your Santa, is that? N no. These are the ones that I made just for these kits. ones um now i think there's these are the ones that um why does it look so dark that um deanna made for y'all and she's already making more so i know the bees are sold out the stars are sold out there's still maybe a couple ladybugs left but not many. They went quickly. Yes, the Unique in the, the Can-Am group is still open. It's not strictly Unique in the Creek, as we do everything in there. Even wire frames, rails, crafts. It's not just Unique in the Creek. We do it all. Centerpieces. Dre is our flower centerpiece whisperer. We have Pam James who comes in once a month and teaches y'all how to fake bake. So we have a good time in there. No, I don't get thrown out. When you love what you do, you can't get burnt out. Now, I can work too much. <laughs> so I do try to, I'm trying to take a day off. I say that. I've only taken one day off since New Year's. But I'm trying to at least give myself an hour or so every day. But even that's not working. Awesome, Cheryl. We do have some fun in there. Oh 
almost done, y'all. There we go. I know. I really need to hire somebody to help me, but y'all, I'm so OCD that I'm afraid to give up that. I mean, I finally hired somebody to run my Pinterest. I've always had somebody run my YouTube, so I've never had to do that, but I don't know. It's given up that control. All right, so we're going to do, how did I do this? One, two, three, four, one, I got them scattered everywhere. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so I'm going to do the four regular ones. And then we can fill in if we need to. So I did cut enough to do that. How do you order the bees and the ladybugs on my website, monkeyscreations.com? Now I always start by just doing the main holes, and then if we need to add on from there, then I fill in the regulars. Yeah, the stars are sold out. The bees are sold out. The last time I looked, there were still a few ladybugs, but not many. Oh, I'm taking it the wrong way. There we go. Okay, so there's the first four. Get that one where it needs to go. So you can still see. See how you can see all that? So we are going to do the four shared holes. You t too bad you are. You live so far. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm just, y'all, I'm just, I'm just too OCD, I think. <laughs> so let's add those four more. And that was in the initial count. Of course it has, Tara. I've been working on it since this morning. I like to be quick. Usually, I love to have all my orders shipping out the next day. Doesn't always happen, but I sure try. But by 9 o'clock at night, y'all, I quit. No matter what I'm doing, I quit. <laughs> Even at that, it makes a long day. I usually start sometimes at 6.30, 7 o'clock in the morning. So by 9, I'm like over it. <laughs> over it. There, that filled in that gap nicely. And on the initial count, I knew we would probably have to do that, so 
Oh, I'm pulling the wrong one. <laughs> My goodness. All right, two more, y'all. Two more. See, it went quick, huh? The prep wasn't so quick, but putting it together goes quickly. We're doing so good. Now see if we had doubled up on the yellow like we did the red, you would have only seen like the ends, the very ends. So that's, that's why I do it this way. Right, and then you just take your Senna. It already has your pipe cleaner on it. Put it through the two holes right there in the middle. And if you want, and you want to just use that red in the four extra, you can. And that will even make your center pop a little bit more by not adding the additional yellow. But totally up to you. However you want to do it. And there you go. Your all ribbon wreath. that totally covers your board, is cute. There you go. And then just find your top. It's got the two holes right there. Use one of your zip ties. Run it right through. You'll take that center, wrap it around. Cut it down. Well, I probably cut that a little too short, but we'll put it in this one. And then put it right back in those holes so you have a totally flat center, or totally flat back. Does that make sense? Look how cute. So looking at it, I almost wish that I didn't add the additional red or yellow because, let me cut one and show y'all. What did I cut it at 12? So 
So if we had put more of that red in the senna, it would have made that yellow pop a little bit more. So I'm just going to slide that kind of under there so you see what I'm talking about. So see how the red plays off that yellow a little bit more so you don't have yellow on yellow. So I may go back and take the extra yellows out and add the red. Does that make sense? Is you still with me? All right, well that is your kit. I hope you enjoy it. I do have more of this coming out. Um, hopefully I'll get the lady, the real ladybug um, and bee kits out tomorrow. Um, oh, my! one of my butterfly kits will be in tomorrow, so I can offer that as well. Um, Facebook just informed you I was live. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go back and I'm going to take the, the yellows, the additional yellows out of the four shared holes. So let me turn it over and show you. Or y'all just want me to do it live? Look, let's just do it. Okay. If you want to hang out, you can hang out. If not, y'all see what the kit will look like. So let me take the center off. Alright, so I'm just going to do the shared ones. So these big ones, I'm just going to turn it over and we're going to smash all that dang ribbon. It's alright, I can fix it. We're going to cut, right, might as well do it. <laughs> that way y'all can really see. So I need three more pieces. And my good scissors are in the kitchen because that's where I cut all these tails. So there's plenty of ribbon still available. To use on another project. Perfect for a rail. If you have a rail, a ladybug rail that you're working on, the perfect ribbon for that. Hey, hey. All right, let me show you what I'm making out of the way. Okay. So I need four more zip ties since we decided to change it up. Or I decided, I guess. <laughs> Look, now all my ribbons flat on the doorknob. You ordered a kit? Awesome. So let's try two 
and I'm just kind of putting them kind of side by side. Yeah, see how that's going to make that yellow really pop now? Yes, it will go on YouTube. This one will go up tomorrow because I already put one on YouTube today from this morning. So I'll get this one loaded tomorrow. Well, I guess I could do it today. Now, if you like the other way better, then just do it whichever way you want. It's a zip tie gun, so it it um, tightens and cuts your zip ties at the same time. talking about this yeah that's a secret I keep to myself so we can bring that one yellow up front if we want but I think I like it better with the mostly red I like that so much better. What do y'all think? With more of that red in the center. And then I'll get all these ribbons fixed up. And not flat. <laughs> Of course, I'll do it better than that. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Definitely makes it pop a little bit more. So there you go. Too cute. Now I'm ready for summer. Bring it on, y'all. All right, I am out of here. This is the large board. Sorry, I got a hair. I wasn't picking my nose. I had a hair on my face. Um, what is today? Tuesday. So I have karate. So I have karate tonight. And then I'll be back home working on orders again after that. And I may 
See you tomorrow. All right. Bye, y'all.